matchup set to go down. Both teams want to get off to a good start. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. I'm James Sebulski. The moment of truth has arrived. It's time to drop the puck. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. The Bruins gain possession in their own end. Works it across to Bushnevich. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Oh, big time use of physicality on that one. Oh, what a save on the play! Oh, that's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about competing, finding a way to get to the puck. And look at this, these fans are starting to get on their feet to recognize what an incredible save we just witnessed. Yeah, he made an incredible one, didn't he? And, and you got to embrace it when they're on their feet and support of you, because you know you hear booze often when you let a bad one in. So embrace it. You can tell that he's feeling it right now. And that's knocked away. And now he angles it across to DeBrusque. Sends it out front. have come out very hungry in this one and look at this they get the one nothing lead the coach was talking to us at the pregame skate about how important it is to get off to a good start not let anyone into the game to start it in your barn and you couldn't have drawn this one up any prettier avoids the poke check great use of the body to knock him off the puck moves it quickly over to shen vancouver's got control of it now from their own end Strong's carrying it ahead. Oh, and here's the pass. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Fulton. Feeds the puck over to Saad. St. Louis has it in the defensive end. Jostles for the puck, but still hangs on. Takes the feed. The Blues take it along the wing. And they'll dump it in. Vancouver's got a hold of it against the wall. Demko is doing everything he can to uplift his team here. Just look at that last sequence. It was so impressive. The way he was desperate and the athleticism shown in that save, he's got to give his team a ton of confidence. Slides it on over to Joseph. Fires it! Makes a save! Vancouver's got it in their own zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Passes on over to Susie. Handles the puck. And he slides it quickly to Proberg. Can't hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Puts it in deep. St. Louis gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Battle along the wall. And the puck's picked free. Taken along the wall by Letty. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. The Blues will play it in their own end. The Canucks look to start the transition game. Quick pass across to Suter. And that's stolen by Sundfist. Played big in the moment there. Great read by Kaepernick. And he gets just enough of it to keep it out to the back of the net. Grabs the puck in the corner. Slides it diagonally to Broberg. Chase right in front. Stopped by the goaltender. And reads the play perfectly and picks up the pass. Neighbors never gave up on that play, James. It's a reason why he's... Oh, look at this. He scores! Oh, wow! What a finish! Well, I love that he used his speed and didn't slow down, James. And it's all about patience and composure, elevating the goaltender, finding the room and burying it. Well, everyone on the bench is up on this one, James. I mean, great speed to be able to break away from the pack, and then you get in all alone with a goaltender, and you got the poise and patience to outweigh the move, and I just love the execution to finish off the deke. Past the halfway mark of this period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. 
Williams won the draw at center. Vancouver's gained possession along the boards. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Rocks him. The Blues have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Good, solid check, and he loses control of it. And tries to make a diagonal pass to DeBrusque. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. He is so dangerous when the puck is on his stick in the offensive zone, but he tries one too many moves, and he loses the puck. Feeds it down low. Now a quick pass to Bushnevich. That's gloved by Demko. Centers are lined up, and we are ready to resume. The Blues win the draw, and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Oh, an unbelievable stop by Dunko. Sends the feet in front. Dishes it off again here. Sprong's got it along the wing. The Blues get a hold of the puck in their own end. St. Louis plays it up ahead. Slides the puck over. And just got a piece of it to keep it out. The Canucks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Oh, he'll feel that one. Sprong's crossed the line and is on the attack now. Oh, what a save! Well, if that doesn't swing momentum in your favor, I don't know what will, James. That's a last-ditch effort to make a play. What a beautiful save. Finnington's all over that shot makes an incredible save, getting to the top of his crease quickly, because that shot, it came fast and in a hurry from the slot. Carries the puck up through center. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. The Blues have it now. Still has possession. Across the line along the left wall. Sends one across. Reads it perfectly in the defensive end. Here in the late going of the frame, we are all tied up in this one. Blugers won a big draw on their own end. On the right side, moves it up ahead. And now he moves it to Bluger. Takes a shot. Stopped by Bennington. Oh, a quick little pickpocket on the play. From the open ice, they gain the line. Hughes takes the puck. And a smart heads-up play to poke that away by Joseph. Moves the puck to the attacking area. The Blues take it from the side. Angles it over to Suter. Sneaks by the poke check. Great reach with the poke check. Inside the final minute of the first here. St. Louis plays it against the boards. And a nice takeaway in the defensive end by Myers. Here they come on the rush. Excellent stick work on the play. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. And it's freed up over to his teammate with a nice kick pass. Shot, and he hangs on just as time runs out. There's the buzzer. Fans seem to enjoy that first 20 minutes. We'll get to the second period right after both teams get a chance to catch their breath. Stick around. They didn't generate any offense, and they weren't attacking with any kind of speed. They're going to have to find a way to shore that up, James, because their opponent is really taking it to them. They're fortunate that this game is still tied. Puck picked up by Krug. 
through the neutral zone up along the wing. Quick pass to Thomas. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. Takes a hit, but still hangs on to the puck. Pinned up along the boards. And he slides it quickly to Hughes. Moves the puck. The Blues have it from their own end. They've got numbers here. Sends the puck across. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We got a tie game. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Demko's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. Puck possession so critical. Another faceoff coming up here. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Scooped up along the wall by Saad. Puck scooped up by Joseph. Booming shot! Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. St. Louis wins the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Grabbed along the board by Saad. Takes a shot. Score! And that's his first goal of the postseason ever. And he'll take it. It's much needed too, James. You get to the playoffs, you want to make sure that your teammates have trust in you and you have trust in yourself because you want to be an impact player. That's a nice start. Leads it by one here in the second. Uh, it's been a competitive back and forth game, and sometimes in these games you gotta grind it out. That's exactly what they did, and they find themselves with the lead. Vancouver's won the draw in the neutral zone. Here's a shot! Big time stop! Picked up along the wall by Pedersen. Huge steal in his own end. St. Louis has been so good shutting down the middle of the ice. They're anticipating the passes and they're closing quickly. And because of that, they're turning pucks over and intercepting them as well. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. St. Louis is trying to build on that one goal lead. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. The Blues take possession in the defensive end. St. Louis has the puck. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Demko's got the puck and he's gonna hang on. St. Louis isn't slowing down in this one. They continue to put a lot of pucks on net and they lead it here in this second. The Blues win that offensive zone faceoff. Oh, the out of the play! Oh, that's a true competitor's save. Just when you think that he's completely out of it, James, he comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive. Oh, here we go. This team knows how to turn up another gear, and they've done that here. There's a catch by the champion. That's picked up by the D. And they skate it out of the danger zone. Keeps a hold of the puck. Picked off by Letty. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Let's see the call here. When you're down a goal, you can't generate any offense if you're shorthanded. They're going to have to be opportunistic, find a way to kill it off, and then reset the momentum. As they step into the face-off circle, let's see if they can take advantage on this power play. First opportunity on the power play in this game. And specialty teams are the difference so many times in a game. Huge for them to set the tone and really get the setup in the looks they're looking for. St. Louis gets the puck near the boards. Kairou's got it in the offensive zone. And that's intercepted by Miller. 
trying to clear the puck from his own end. Can't get it out as they tried to play it off the glass. And this is a tough one. You know the coach isn't going to like it. One, they needed a line change. And two, if you get it out, now you can contest the entry. And that's the most difficult place for the PP to get in the zone. Moves it to Thomas. Jostling for the puck and he loses control. And they manage to clear it. Nice poke check. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Takes a shot. Just saved by Bennington. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Suitors recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Nice job tying up his opponent. Luger is almost back on the ice. Man advantages up, both teams back to even strength. Coach won't be happy with that, James. Didn't make the PK unit move at all. You have to create some motion and make adjustments based on what they're doing, and this power play unit didn't do any of it. More than half the frame has been played here. St. Louis is in the driver's seat. They lead it 2-1 in what has been a very spirited affair. And they win the face-off and set up to go on the attack. Oh, what a blocker stop by Denko. Oh, they do it again. Denko has been dominant in the crease tonight. He's turned away a lot of high danger shots, and he's really found a way to build some momentum for his team, give him a real opportunity to win. The Blues continue to lead it here in the second period. They have been very active in the offensive zone tonight. Shen's won the draw. it up we'll get a stoppage in play the officials are in position and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face off here the blues win the draw now let's see what they can do with it and bounce off a stick in traffic looks to make a play over to garland the canucks carry it along the wall Shen's got it along the boards. Here they come on the attack. Oh, and the answer on that one. Puck is frozen and we'll get a face off. The Canucks start with the puck in their own end. And here's the pass to Besser. Moving into the attacking zone. That's some smart heads up defensive play by Kapanen. The Blues are doing a great job of anticipating the play, and that's why the puck is on their stick. They're intercepting pucks all game long. They've got to make good on them. They've got to transfer it, head north, and start cashing in. Strong defensive effort taken by Pareko. And now he moves it quickly to Holloway. Oh, look at the pass! And that's broken up with a stick in front. The Canucks have it now. Takes a knock, but he's still got the puck. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. Moves it to the middle, and that's intercepted. Takes the feed up ahead. Shot! Oh, you might call that friendly fire as it goes off one of his teammates. Vancouver's got it in their own zone. Passes it over. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Demko. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight to the crease. He got out and challenged right away to make the save. And it's a quick pass to Thomas. Solid check to slow him down. The Blues gain possession in their own end. Slides the puck to Broberg. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Oh, look at this chance. Shuts him down. Dishes it off. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. Gets the puck in deep. St. Louis takes hold of the puck. Letty's got it in the defensive end. The Canucks have it in the offensive zone. Peterson's going to hang on to a whistle. St. Louis has turned good defense into offense. Plenty of scoring opportunities. And they lead here late in the second. They win the draw and go on the attack. Too much traffic in the lane. And he takes the feed. Quick feed to Torpchenko. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. The Blues have it against the wall. 
Looking for space inside the D zone. Here's a short pass to Fulk. Puck grab by Torchenko. The Canucks will play from the defensive zone. And he takes the feed. Moves it quickly over to Neighbors. There's the buzzer bringing period number two to a close. Hey, listen, we've got lots more in store here on this broadcast, so don't even think about going anywhere with Dr. Gormal. Vancouver's got to be better in the third period, no question about it. They've got to be more aggressive on the puck, and they've got to attack the lanes when they get the opportunity. They've had very few shots on net, and they're fortunate this is a close game. If they want to get back in it, they've got to get into the offensive zone. They've got to get net front presence, and they have to shoot at all costs. Along the half wall with the puck. Oh, he gets a blocker on a pass. Stopped by Bennington. Directs it on over to Bushnevich. Great read by Miller. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Fires it into the offensive zone. And he slides it quickly to Miller. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Puck picked up by Bushnevich. Feeds it over. Fantastic save. Scores. The defender put it into his own net. The Blues pick up right where they left off. And look at this, a quick goal here to go up in the third. Yeah, and that's deflating for their opponent. You can see it in the body language, and that's also a signal to them that they need to continue to press attack while they're down. Shen's quick stick lands on the puck here at center. Knocks the puck down with the stick. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Joseph. The Blues have been the more active squad offensively tonight, and they lead it early in this third period. Shen's won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Can't keep a hold of it. Vancouver's ready to go on the attack. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Vancouver's got the puck. Quick pass to Garland. They go on the attack from the left side. St. Louis looks to move the puck from their own end. Sends it over to Shen. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. And now it's grabbed by Sprong. Stones him in front. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. St. Louis players were saying earlier this morning that they wanted to create more offense. They have done just that, and they lead here in the third. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Now a quick pass to Torpchenko. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. St. Louis looks to get things going now with the puck. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Moves it around along the half wall. Slides it across, and that doesn't reach the net. Blocker save. Takes it from the other side of the blue line. Denies him again. Oh man, he's so dialed in. Makes consecutive saves there and keeps his team in it. Look at this attack! Coming up and sure how much they could want it down for both sides here. We know that the goaltender is extremely fatigued, and just look at the last shift. I mean, in their own zone, finding ways to get the puck out, and of course, the opponent just owning play, hemming them in, and finding ways to get the puck to the net. So they got to continue that pressure. And if you're on the goaltender side, you got to make sure you get it out of the zone and give them some rest. 
getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. The Blues have been getting solid offensive contributions, leading 3-1. Takes the pass. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Here's a chance. Comes up with the stop. Moves it to Thomas. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Demko's got the puck, and he's going to slow things down. Well, he's slowing things down because his team has been under siege, James. It's the third period. It's a tight game, and he elects to get the whistle. I like this decision. It's the right one. Now everyone can get a rest, and Coach can get the right personnel out there. Picked up along the boards by DeBrusque. Passes it over. Make it a double G. The great glove save. I'm not sure how he kept up to that shot right from the slot area, James, but man, he flashed the leather. He made the save, no rebound to boot. Well, the emotion elevates after a save like that, James, and even on replay, it's happening again for me. I mean, that was absolutely unbelievable. Everyone's standing on their feet. They cannot believe that he made that save. Past the midway mark of the frame, it's a two-goal lead we're looking at with the score 3-1. St. Louis wins the draw. Sends a pass over. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Hughes picks up the puck. Tosses it to DeBrusque. Smart defensive play there. And he passes it up ahead to Bushnevich. Oh, he pokes it away. A risky play, but it pays off. Tries to feed it over to Hirono. Answers up with an even better save. Quick feed to Krug. St. Louis moves ahead with the puck. The Blues played along the wing. Takes the puck behind the net. Knocked around, but keeps it going. Moves it to the middle. And that's stopped. The Canucks move it ahead. Puck dumped in and the forwards are gonna skate off. St. Louis looks to break out in their own end. Levels up into the wall. The Canucks get a hold of it. Take it along the wall by Pedersen. Simmering feed! And he denies that great opportunity there. have been peppering shots on goal all night long and they continue to lead in the third. St. Louis has the puck here off the faceoff. And he's ridden off the puck. And that's stopped by the goaltender. Great save to stay with him. Stops him again. On the sequence of saves, I love how he's strong he is in his set position here, James. You can see that he gets squared to the shooter and that makes the second save easier. Here's a short pass to Falk. Great glove save by Demko. A big face off here inside the offensive end. Sunfis won the draw there on the attack. Oh, he hammered him. Vancouver's got a hold of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Myers. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. And that's denied by Bennington. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. The Blues gain control of the puck. From the point, they take control of it. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Demko's going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. And they'll start with position. Dishes it off. Moves the puck down low. Vancouver's got possession of the puck. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Slides the puck across to Bushnevich. Denied by the goaltender. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. 
In the final moments of this period, the Blues are up 3-1. The Blues send their man advantage unit out once more. When the power play is struggling, you got to get pucks to the net. And you have to have net front presence. Take away the tender's eyes. You know they work on it from a young age. Puck tracking skills, anticipation. Don't let the tender see the puck. Quick shot! Oh, stops it with a goal! Great reflexes there! Oh, bro. 
might be your first blood in the series, Cheryl. Uh, yeah, and that's exactly how they would have drawn it up, James. You want to make sure that you are the one that establishes the play and pace of the game right off the top, and you want to set the tone. Well, they did that, and now their opponent's squeezing their sticks a little tight. Well, that'll do it for tonight's postseason action, but the playoffs roll on, and we will see you at the next game. From all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Sabalski. Good night.